Scrub Project, Gravity Assisted Pulse Motor Update. Uh, we went back to uh, the uh, heavy gauge wire, so it's either 12 or 13 AWG on both sides. Uh, I have them connected in series, and when I measured the resistance, it turned out to be approximately 1 ohm. My, either, my meter is not the best, and uh, so I'm saying approximate. And uh, so that'll get, you know, 12 amps. You know, at 12 volts, and uh, you know, but the uh, the MOSFETs are only rated at uh, 125 watts, and uh, so I stuck four of them in parallel <laughs> because uh, I was tired of burning them up, and uh, we attached little uh, homemade heat sinks to each one with uh, we're using a little bit of thermal compound down there. Uh, as it turns out, the uh, MOSFETs I bought they are real inexpensive uh, from overseas. And uh, when they shipped them to me, they stuck them in baggies instead of uh, static resistant, uh, con you know, uh, packages. And uh, as a result, uh, a large quantity of them are not, are not functioning. So that attributed to a lot of the problems we had earlier as I was trying to test with uh, MOSFETs that weren't, uh, that weren't working properly, you know, that weren't working to begin with. And, uh, but at this time, so about 30 or 40 watts are going through, uh, you know, each of the, each of the MOSFETs. And, uh, when we turn it on, yeah, we're, we're getting a, an effect. You know, it's working. At least it sounds like it's working. And, uh, yeah, this is the effect at the other end. We have, uh, way too much weight on, uh, on the uh, pendulum, and yeah, you know, that's stopping it with my hand. So, uh, so we'll have to uh, add more weight to the other end. I'll have to go to the uh, hardware store and pick up some uh, bolts, uh, <laughs> bolts, nuts, and washers, and uh, we'll increase the weight and uh, yeah, we we should be able to get better performance. Uh, but uh, as far as wattage or amps uh, going through the coils, um, I don't know. <laughs> I think we just about maximized it at 12, wa uh, 12 amps. Uh, you know, closer to 20, we're going to get more uh, performance. If then we uh, run into the problem with, uh, you know, uh, burning up the sets because of uh, overheating. So, uh, anyways, it's uh, kind of working at this point. And, uh, you can see the, uh, the frame is squeaking like crazy and, uh, needs a lot of, uh, beefing up or stabilization. And, uh, that may help with, uh, increasing the, uh, the pulse. But, uh, we're, uh, <laughs> making small gains as we go along. So, thanks for watching. Enjoy the day. We'll, uh, run this for a while and, uh, See what kind of drain it sticks on the battery. Cool. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Cheers.